Hi guys, welcome back to Goose Grills. Uh, today is the 9th of December and we're having an early Christmas because my whole family are coming up, from, uh, coming up from London, coming down from London, whichever way you want to look at it, do you know what I mean? And so tomorrow we're having a big old Christmas dinner and this is probably the first time in my life where I don't mind things coming early, you know what I mean? <laughs> anyway, listen, so I'm doing a turkey breast, I'm doing a beef and I'm doing a ham. I'm going to show you how I'm going to do this turkey breast because you've pretty much seen the other ones already. So first things first, Always, always, in my opinion, if you're doing turkey, any way, shape or form, brine it, okay? Brine it all night. It's the best thing. Sometimes turkey can be a bit dry because I only do the breast or the crown, whichever you want to call it. Um, so, you know, it, it works a treat. It makes it lovely and juicy. It makes it nice and tasty. Happy days, mate, do you know what I mean? Can't, help it, can't beat on a Christmas day. And I always use a crown because it's just fucking easy, isn't it? I mean, it saves a lot of fucking about. I just keep slicing it like that, bosh. Happy days, everyone's a fucking winner. Right, first things first. Okay, in here guys, we have one gallon of stock. Now you've got to make sure it's cold. I've had this sitting outside undercover, fucking trying to cool it down all that well. Probably I put this on, it's probably been cooling down for about six hours now. Anyway, it's lovely and cold. You can't have it warm in any way, shape or form because it's gonna sit in there all night. We don't want the, uh, the stock to start cooking the uh, turkey in any way, shape or form, all right? So, first things first. What we're gonna do is you're gonna to have to take yourself a food, get yourself a food safe container. Then, very easy, pick up turkey. That goes in there, all right? Let's get that out of the way, pull this over. We have our stock. There's about a gallon in there, do you know? But I mean, pff, You've got to play around with it. So you're going to use as what you ever you need to make sure you cover that turkey. You may need less. Sometimes you might need less, depending on how big your turkey is. You know, that fits in there quite comfortably. I don't even know I'm going to need all this, but I might do. We'll see what it happens. But first things first, are you ready? In there, you've got about a cup of salt, okay? I use kosher. It's entirely up to you. All right. In there, we've got half a cup of uh, dark brown sugar. You can use light as well. I don't really make, think it makes too much odds. Then to that, we're gonna have a sprinkle of uh, peppercorns, whole peppercorns. <laughs> Silly song. I'm getting excited. We're gonna have like, a proper full on Christmas day tomorrow. I, can't, I literally can't wait. I do love Christmas. You know what I mean? The, uh, my wife's decorated the house amazingly. It looks like fucking Santa's grotto in there. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> if someone with a white fucking beard asks you to sit on his knee, just be careful, all right? <laughs> Right, then the next thing I'm gonna do, guys, is just a little bit of pickling spice. They don't have to use it, but I used this one year, and do you know what? I quite like the taste of it, so I thought, fuck it. So I'm just gonna give that another little sprinkle in there. All right, then to that, what we're gonna do was we're just gonna add two halves of a lemon in they pop, flippity flop, and then two halves of an orange. In fact, I'm actually going to go into quarters in this, just so I can get a little bit more surface area. Okay, that, 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 and that in there. Bosh. Now, I'm just going to give that a stir up, just so that the salt can dissolve, okay? It won't take long, believe you me. I mean, <laughs> you're getting that nice little citrusy smell with it now, which is nice. Um, and then, it's, it's very straightforward. We're going to pour this over the top of that turkey breast, and we're going to stick it in the fridge till tomorrow. And then once we've done that, she's coming out of there, we're gonna go into the fucking Traeger because we are smoking this bad boy. I am gonna be using the uh, Angus and Oink winner winner chicken dinner to coat the uh, turkey in before she goes in the smoker. And that was my free gift from them, by the way, which I was very happy to receive. <laughs> So it's going to be the first time I'm trying it, and I actually can't wait. But, hey -oh. right, so just want to give this a stir up so all that salt and all that sugar dissolves. It start off, makes, start off makes the old water look a little bit murky, but it is a brine. But I promise you, please, if you're going to do anything this year to your turkey, brine it for the night. It, it makes such a bloody difference, and everyone will be a fucking... All that is a juicy bird. Oi, can't lie, you can't fucking not love a juicy bird, can you? You know what I mean? <laughs> Right, that is just about us. Very straightforward, guys. Let's pull this over. There goes the old knife. Very simple, right? All I'm going to do is pour this straight in there. All I want to do is make sure this is completely submerged. Ta -da! And there you have it, guys. Okay, simple as. If she starts to float up a little bit, you can just chuck a plate on the top of her. All right? And then bring you back. And guys, it is as simple as that. 
all right? Now, I'm gonna see you tomorrow once this bad boy has been brining all night. <laughs> Literally, I can't wait. Honestly, I do love this. I do love a bit of turkey. And it's going to be smoked in the tray. Go, oh, winner, winner. Turkey dinner. <laughs> right, guys, I shall see you tomorrow. <laughs> Merry Christmas. <laughs> right, guys, welcome back. This bad boy's been brining all night. I literally, I'm so excited. We're having a proper Christmas day today. Hence the Christmas out, uh, the old Christmas outfit. Even got right down to a Christmas tea towel. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> I know it ain't Christmas yet, but you've got to celebrate when you can celebrate. Anyway, next stage, guys. As I said to you, this bad boy's been brining all night. She is going to be juicy as fuck. So all we're going to do, very simple, is that's just a reminder. We're going to give a little spray of the old uh, Popeye's missus, a bit of the old olive oil. Now, you may see me later on today. I'm probably going to get more and more pissed. So you're just going to have to bear with me as this goes on. Do you know what I mean? All right, and then... What we're gonna do, actually, I'll tell you what we'll do, we'll start at the bottom, because I wanna get it all. And then we are gonna be using winner, winner, chicken dinner, courtesy of Angus Anoint. This is one of the ones that they sent me. I am so pleased to give this a go. Been looking, oh, easy tiger. I've been looking forward to using this stuff, because everyone keep, I keep seeing it on the internet. But AO, listen, all we're gonna do is give this a smother, all right? Happy days. Get it everywhere. Watch, oh, you know, it smells very chickeny. Lovely. Then let's give her a flip. One, two, three. Now I'm going under as well, guys. Want to get it all in. Lovely. Pull that back. Pull that skin back. <laughs> it's not fair on her otherwise. <laughs> right, anyway. Um, here we go. Lovely. Plenty of it, guys. The old Traeger is up to temp. We're sitting on 350 today for this. And I reckon this is probably going to take a couple of hours because we're going to smoke this bad boy. And there she go. Look at that. Don't that look pretty? Right. Let's get this bad boy in the Traeger. Very simply. Woohoo! In she goes. Straight in the middle, guys. Lovely jubbly. Time to get the old probe in. That is going in there. Now we'll be shooting for about 165, guys. So I shall see you probably about halfway through because I can't have little butchers at it. Do you know what I mean? Right, we'll see you then. Right, guys, we're at the hour mark. Oh, happy days. Look at that. Not long now, guys. Not long. Right, I'll see you soon. Right, guys, we have hit temp. Are you ready? Ah, fucking look at that. That looks beautiful. Right, let's get this bad boy out of here, shall we? First things first, let's move, remove the probe. Stay there. Out she goes. Okay, are you ready? One two three and there you have it guys that is beautiful winner winner chicken dinner or winner winner turkey dinner or christmas is coming or whatever you want to say it looks pretty right time for rest guys i'll see you when she's rested the rest is over I can lie to you. Look, I've got a house full of guests. Do you know what I mean? It's pretty fucking crazy in there. It's a bit cold out here. Sun's trying to come out. But I'm going to give this a quick flip round. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to do a quick... Oh, fucking hear that skin. You hear that? <laughs> I'm going to I'm going to have a quick try. So we slice a bit right off the end there. Oh, mate. That, that went through there like a knife through butter. Let's go again. That was pretty there. Let's go again, look at that, oh. Can you see the juice coming out of that? And that is what happens when you brine, guys. I promise you, if you're gonna do anything this year to your turkey, brine. Look at that. All right, are you ready? Cut that through there. Take that bit off the end. Nice bit of skin on there with our winner winner chicken dinner on there. Are you ready? Oh, oh mate. Oh, guys, that is fucking. I've got to go again. I want to get a bit of that chicken dinner. I'm going to go. That's all the fat on that end. You know what? Fuck it. I'm going to go this end. I want to cut that bit off there because it's got all that seasoning on there. Bit of board. Oh, that is fucking beautiful, guys. 
absolutely fucking beautiful. I promise you. Winner, winner, chicken dinner on your turkey for Christmas. Happy days. I promise you, if anyone put that in front of you, you wouldn't be upset. Now remember, don't forget to push all the fucking buttons and I'll see you next time.